morning, Colonel Bai. Today is Friday, May 31st, and it's a day two. I'm Ahmed. And I'm Kushal. And, and here, here are your morning announcements. announcements. Colonel Bai grads, vote for your class valedictorian by completing the grad survey that had been emailed to you by Ms. Nack by June 5th. This year's valedictorian will be announced at your grad breakfast, which is taking place on June 7th from 8 to 9 a.m. Hey, Kushal, it's been a while since we hung out. Any suggestions for what we can do? Well, I don't know if I want to hang out with you, but if you do want to hang out, CB Fest is June 5th at 3.30 to 6. It's an outdoor concert behind the music portable. There are at least three bands and some individual performances. Bring blankets to sit on. Well, that's, that's all, all from us today, CB. Now here's your Friday show. What's good, Colonel Bai? Today we're out here at Mer Bleu Golf Driving Range and Mini Foot. This is where people come to practice their golf swings. Go check it out. I'm with Ashley. Ashley, how are you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. Ashley, could you introduce yourself and tell us what your role here is at Merbleu? All right. So I'm an employee here. When I work alone, I work like basically everything. So the driving range, the mini putt, the batting cages, and yep. Yeah. So it must be a big job to monitor everything by yourself. But I'm sure there's some enjoyable things about your job. Can you tell us what your fit most uh, favorite role or part is here at Merbleu? Yeah, so I like meeting new people. And just because it's my first job, I like, you know, new, new experiences. And um, yeah. Yeah. Have you had any memorable experiences or memories working here? Well, yeah, um, there was one day I was working at the mini putt and there was just like a bunch of of um, frogs just like oh. around the pond. Yeah. Yeah. So Ashley, could you tell us what separates Mer Bleu from other mini putts and golf ranges? Yeah, no problem. So over here, it's beautiful. Like that's why I love working here. There's ponds, there's beautiful like trees and plants and everything. It's just really wonderful to just like stand outside and be a part of like this nature. Yeah. Now that we're in summer, like I can see the greenery, it's really enjoyable. Yeah. Two for two. I'm here with Kaden. Kaden, how you doing? Good, you? Yeah. I'm good. Kaden, can you introduce yourself and tell us how long you've been coming to Mer Bleu? Uh, I'm Kaden. I go to CIH. It's just a hockey school in Rockland, and I've been at this range for a couple of years now, like two to three. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. So we're personally new golfers. Um, do you have any tips for new beginners um, involving golfing and putting? I mean, like, I'm not that good myself, but any tips I'd say is um, try to keep your eye on the ball, always keep your head down, and let the club do the work. Try not to kill the ball all the time. So you said you go to a hockey school. Yeah. Do you feel like your experience with hockey helps at all in golfing? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I think very it nice. It plays a factor. Yeah. And this is more of a personal question. If yeah. you could play a game of golf with any three people, famous, alive, dead, doesn't matter, yeah. who would you choose? Uh, Tiger Woods, for sure. Uh, Brooke Henderson, I'm a big fan of her. And probably I'd throw in like Cole Caulfield, one of the young hockey players out there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm with Das. Das, how are you doing? Good, you? I'm good. Das, can you tell us how long you've been coming to Mer Bleu and uh, how long you've been golfing for? I've been coming here for two to three years. I've also been golfing for the same amount of time. Very nice. So for any golfer, golfing must be a passion. But unfortunately, we can't play outdoors during the winter. So are there any activities that you prefer to do in the winter when you can't be golfing? Uh, I like to go to the uh, outdoor rinks around here. Mm -hmm. they're, uh, they're pretty good. For hockey? Yes. Very nice. So I know a lot of people say it's the golfer, not the equipment, but how important is it for you to have proper and good equipment? I'd say it's not that important for me because okay, okay. my equipment isn't the best, but it, it, it helps, but yeah. it's all, it's, it is also the golfer. 
Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you.